Good Monday morning, everybody. Roll your shoulders back and around. Big shoulder rolls. Oh, get out that stiffness from, I don't know. I'd say sleeping, but I don't sleep. And then reverse it. Bring it forward and around. Good. Just like you're doing a couple strokes swimming. And then take yourself into torso rotations. Hi, Cindy. Good morning. We just, <laughs> we just got started. We're just moving ourselves side to side. Give me four more, three more, two more, one more. Come to center, take a wide stance, put your hands on your thighs and bend your knees. Round your back, pull it in, arch your back, extend your spine. Round it and back and round, scoop the belly in and arch one more time. Round, hold it here and then press your right shoulder forward. Change to the other side. Bring it forward. Come back to center, round it again, pull the belly in, and then extend it and take it side to side in lunges. Keep your shoulders over your hips. Good morning, Debbie. Roll side to side. Good. Hi, we're just warming up. Give me four more of these. Four, three, hold it on your left side. One, hold it there, chest is up. Good, drop your hips a little bit lower and up and down and up, and down and up. Good, give me four of these. Four, three, two more. Hi, Julia, Julia, one more. Take your right hand to the floor, spin it around, drop your hip down, little pulses. And then hold, take the left arm up and twist. Open your chest, three, two, Left hand down, bring your back foot in a little bit closer, straighten the front leg. Oh, my hamstrings are really tight, so my leg's not gonna go straight by any stretch of the imagination. In four, three, two, come back to center, bend your knees, good, roll it up. Take your feet wide again, lunging side to side, just for four more of these. Four, three, two, hold it on your right side. Drop the hips and up. Up and down. Three, two, one, hold it down, turn around to your right side, left hand down, drop your hips. And hold it there, right arm opens up, twist. Hang it there for four, three, two and one, bring your hands down, step your back foot a little closer, straighten your front leg, as you can tell, my hamstrings are tight. Who's that? Oh, Lauren, you bet. Randy, is that you? I can't see. <laughs> oh, Joe, hi. There you are. All right, good morning. Turn back around to the front. Hands on the floor, bend your knees and drop your seat a little bit lower. Spread your knees apart with your arms and push your knees against your arms. And then straighten your legs, hang. Take your arms behind your back. Interlace your fingers, arms overhead, head down and breathe. Three, two, bend the knees to roll up one all the way up. Good, stretch the arms all the way overhead. Lean side to side. And let's grab some weights and start to work. So we're gonna do some squats and lunges in the beginning. Those of you who are not doing squats and lunges, you might be doing some calf raises, you might be doing some ball squats, or do some um, upper body work that you choose to do. I'll let you choose that today. So we've got 10 reps only, I like to say only, because. 10 reps feels very doable sometimes. All right, take your feet about hips width apart, maybe a little bit wider. We're gonna change it up in a bit. All right, let's start with 10 squats. So actually, you can have a weight in your hand. You can have one weight in each hand. All right, it's up to you. If your knees are feeling sensitive, don't go deep in your squat. Four, on the other hand, if you wanna add some jumping to it. Six, weight into your heels. Seven, eight, Two more, nine, and 10. Come on back up. Step your left foot back into a low lunge, and we're gonna go down and up, 10. So my knees are feeling a little sensitive, so I'm keeping it a little higher. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, 10. Come back to center. We're gonna put a combination of those two together. 
So we're gonna squat here, turn and lunge. That's one rep, all right? So you're gonna squat to your right, or you're gonna squat, you're gonna turn to your right side for your lunge. In four, three, two, here we go. Squat down, turn, that's one. Squat, that's two. Squat, three, get the full rotation, four, Make sure both toes turn to your right side. Five, turn. Six, turn. Good, all the way. Make sure that front foot turns with you. Seven, eight, good. Nine, and 10. And come back up. All right, so very important that the leg, that your side that you're turning to, also pivots. That it doesn't stay forward when your body goes that way. All right, so we don't wanna torque it out. Start with squats. Here we go. In four, three, just 10 squats. 10, nine, eight, seven. Remember, if you're not doing squats, you could be doing bridges, ball sits, five, Four, three, two, one more. Good, now step your right foot back. Big lunge on the ball of the back foot, down and up for 10, here we go. One, two, tuck your tailbone under. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. Feet apart, a little bit wider. One squat, one rotation to the left side. Full rotation, both feet go to the left side. In three, two, go. One squat, turn. Two, turn. Three. So if you guys are wearing running shoes, good news, go running in them. Bad news, not great for lateral movement or rotation. Five more. You have to actually pick up your foot if you need to. Four, three, two, last one. One, and done, shake it out. All right, shake out your legs. Go to a moderate to heavy weight for the next exercise. We're gonna repeat both afterwards. So the first exercise, let's stand, we'll face the right side, since we just faced the left side. One weight in your hand. You're gonna do one row and complete it, one rack, raise up, windmill down. It's like four things in one. So it's one complete row, rack your weight, stand up, Push it up, a windmill. This front leg, this right leg right now, is staying bent. It doesn't straighten throughout the entire exercise. All right, so four things in one, we got 10 of those. Left hand holds the weight, right hand can be on your thigh or off to the side. Let's start, three, two, left hand has the weight. So we've got one row, one rack, press it up, windmill, that's one exercise, or one rep, excuse me. Row, rack, press, two. Keep the front knee bent. Row, rack, press, three. Keep going, let me watch you. Row, full row. Rack it at your shoulders, press it, and go inside your leg for windmill. Good, good, this is five, row, Rack, press, windmill. You should feel that right glute. Six, up, good. Seven, good, rack it, press it, and then you bring it back to your shoulder. Eight, row, press, down, up. Nine, 
Last one on this side. Bring it down through your shoulder with control, everybody. Down, up. Come back and we're switching sides. Left toes to the left. So you're pretty much facing this left side the entire time, all right, until the windmill. Left, nothing else changes, that leg stays bent. Three, two, right hand holds the weight. One, let's go. One row, finish it, rack it, press it, down up. Bring it down. Two, rack, press, down up. Good. Three, rack, press, down up. Four, rack, press, down up. Shoulder. Five. Good, break through your obliques here. Six. Down up. Good, seven. A lot of these compound exercises, they're tough. They get a whole lot of your body in. Eight, down, up, press. Good, I recommend the windmills. Nine, good, down, up, one more. 10, rack, press, down, up, and bring it in. All right, windmills for your waistline. Your hips are there, your shoulders, your back. We've done a lot of, a lot of body parts in just two exercises. We're going back to the first. 10 squats, 10 lunges, then we rotate or we pivot. Pivot! All right, ready? Here we go, I cracked myself up. 10 squats, 10, nine, eight. Your hips might feel a little bit more warmed up. Seven, especially between the squats, lunges, six, and the windmills. Five, weight in your heels. Four, three, drive into your heels. Two, one more time. One, good, step your left foot back, right foot forward, split lunge. 10, drive into your front heel, two, three. Was there a convention going on there, Deb? Five, <laughs> six, seven, hi Eric. Eight, two more, nine, and 10. Feet a little bit wider. Squat, turn to your right side in three, two, one, let's go. Squat, pivot, make sure, pivot. Make sure front toes go with you, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more, and ten. Good. It's a swimming pool out here, guys. All right, back to your squat. Four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Does it hurt? One, two, three. Again, weight is in your heels. Four. I don't care how deep you go. Five, as long as your form is good. Six, and you're getting some kind of mobility. Seven, eight, nine. 10, right foot back, split squat, go. 10, two, three, four, five, six, can you not see me? Seven, eight, nine, 10. Combination, feet a little wider. In three, two, one, squat, Pivot, lunge. Two, lunge. Three, four, 
five, feel the burn. Six, embrace the burn. Seven, eight, sorry, I have to sing with Kelly. Nine, one more, 10, and release it. All right, shake it out. Grab some water if you need it. Back to our windmills and rows. Turning to your right side. It's not a huge step, right? It's not, it's not a plie step. Right toes forward, toward the right. Right hand can be on your thigh. Left toes are slightly, it's kind of like a short triangle or a short warrior two. Ready, three, in yoga, two, one. Let's do the rows. Full row, rack, press, windmill, and down. Two, rack it, press, down up. Three, four, five, good. That's it. Six. You might feel your waistline tomorrow. Seven. In a good way. Eight. Good. Two more. Nine. And ten. And come up, switch sides. Left toes to the left. Soft bend in the knee. It stays bent the whole time. Three, two, let's go. One row, rack, press, down and up. One. Two. Three. Four. Don't move that knee. Five. Six. Seven. Hang in there. Three more. Two. Ooh, one more. Come up. Bring it down. All right, y'all. All y'all, go ahead and grab a second weight. Moving on. We're gonna do some biceps, triceps, shoulders. So you might have to accommodate lighter weight at one part or another. The first exercise, bicep curl, open shirt, in, down, that's one rep. So if you wanna do a hammer, that's fine, and just open your arms that way with a different shoulder positioning, or keep your shoulders open. See how it feels on your shoulder, most important. All right, so we've got 10 of those, this is one. Up, open, in, close, uh, in, down. All right, let's try it in four. Three, two, go. Curl, open, in, one. Curl, open, in, two. Curl, open, in, three. Curl, open, keep your elbows in close. In, down, good. Four, open, in, down. Five, open, in, six, seven, eight, two more, up, open, in, last one, 
Curl, open, in, down. Good, roll your shoulders. All right, now the next one is a tricep and a rear delt. You're both of these, you're in a bent over position, so if your back starts to feel it, come up and stretch and come out of it. So it's one curl, uh, one tricep, one rear fly. All right, you can stand up in between sets or reps or just stay with it for 10. All right, everybody pick up your weights. Make a change if you need to. Bend over, elbows in, three, two, one, kick back. One, fly, two, fly, three, fly, four, fly, good, five, Good. Just remember if you stand up for the side raise or the delt, it's a, um, it's a side raise. Good. Six, up, just changes the muscle. Seven, eight, nine, one more, 10, let it go. Now, we're going to do one exercise standing and seated. So get your mats out if they're not. So the first exercise is a standing single leg deadlift. The second exercise is a single leg bridge on the floor. Okay? So we're going to go up and down. Take a weight, one or two weights, your choice. See where you want to be today. Bend the right knee and place very little weight into the right foot. Left leg is softly bent. From the side, it's here. It's not a squat, okay? So weight is in your left leg. The right leg is just to balance, or you take that leg off the floor, okay? Holding on with either hand, two hands, one hand, one weight, whatever you choose. I like to have the opposition to me. So my right hand is holding. My left leg is doing work. In three, two, go. 10, nine, Eight, this just shows me how tight my hips are today. Seven, keep your eye gaze forward. Six, look forward. Very little weight in that right leg. Five, maybe you're balancing on it. Four, three, two more, one more. Good, if you like a weight on your pelvis, bring it with you. Come down to the floor. Left leg stays on the floor. Right leg is in the air. Keep the knees close together. On your heel if you want more hamstrings. And three, two, lift. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two more. One more. Good, let your feet come down. We'll take it from the back side of it. So we'll start with the leg down since we're on the floor. Left leg knee by knee. Heel down if you want your uh, more hamstrings. And three, two, go. 10, remember if you want to weight on your pelvis, that's fine. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. One more, bring it down. Come back up to standing. Take your weight with you, of course. Weight is in the right leg. Left heel up. Weight in the right heel. In four, three, two. Here we go. One. Come all the way up. Two. Look forward. Don't let your back round. Three. Four. Good, keep your chin tucked in, in line with your spine. Five, six, there's no weight in that left leg. Maybe you're balancing seven, eight. You can balance the whole time or not. Nine, one more. And come back up, all right. All right, one more set. Bicep to open shirt, tricep to rear delt, or if you stand up, it's a side raise. You choose if it feels better for your back, absolutely. 
Always take care of your back, your knees, shoulders, wrists, elbows. Okay, pick up your two weights, moderate to heavy. Bicep to open shirt. In four, three, two, here we go. Curl, open, in and down one. Curl, open, that's two. Curl, open, if you're not on with me, that's okay, just do your own count. Four, five, we're doing 10. Six, seven, eight, you can see my sweat again, nine, one more, 10, and down, good. All right, change your weights if you need to. We're going to uh, 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 triceps, <laughs> kick back to a rear delt. In four, bend over three, two, here we go. One, out, two, out, three, four, five, six, good, watch that neck. Nice guys, seven, eight, nine, one more, Ooh. and down. All right, I'm using a single weight. Feel free to use more. All right, I'll get it back later. Weight in the left leg. Three, two, here we go, deadlift. Down, drive through that left heel. Chest is open. Good, it's not a squat, remember. So nothing changes about my lower body, really. Four, five, looking forward in front of you, six, good job, seven, eight, two more, then we go on the floor, nine, and ten, come onto the floor, lay on your back, put your Right leg in the air, air. And then bring it by your knee. Come onto your heel of your left leg. Three, two, one, let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, hug your knees to your chest. I like a spinal twist. Uh, I don't know if you could hear that, it was pretty loud. All right, let's keep the right leg on the floor. Left knee by right leg on your heel. Three, two, go. 10, nine, eight. We're gonna go right into the uh, deadlift. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, come on up to standing. Actually, I'm gonna keep that weight there. Let's go back up to our single leg deadlift. Weight is in the right leg this time in four, three, two, let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, don't round your back, look forward. Three, two, one more. Ooh -wee. All right. Put your weights down. We're gonna go onto the floor. I'm gonna give you a couple options. Some of you, I know, prefer not to be on your knees, so feel free to stay standing if that's the case. We're doing a kneeling row. So, I'll face front. You can face your side. My left leg is forward. My right hand has the weight. Good. All right. My left arm is resting on my thigh, but it is not putting weight into it, right? I'm not putting any pressure into it. It's just there to keep me like kind of balanced. All right, so pick up one heavy weight. Adjust your um, screens for me. 
Cindy and Deb a little bit. I think everybody else I can see um, because I believe we're here for the remainder. All right, so just turn it so I can see you on the floor. And Karen, if this isn't good for you, stand up and do a one-armed row, okay? So pick up your weight. That's it, Sin, thank you. All right, make it as heavy as you want or can. You can sit on a stability ball, or you can put one hand on a stability ball and stand up behind it. In four, three, two, let's row. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, I'm gonna combine another move. One, stand up on your knee. Not on your knee, but just slightly in front of it. If your left foot is forward, the weight's over your right shoulder. You're gonna cross the, bo cross the body with a chop. Here we go. 10, nine, maybe tuck the right toes underneath you. Seven, six, five, these bunnies are getting fatter. Four, three, two, one more. One, good. Weight down, switch sides. Again, if you're standing, if you're on a stability ball, whatever you're doing, it's a single arm and a cross body chop. Weight on that right, uh, weight in the right heel, right forearm is just for balance, ready? Left arm rows, 10, two. For balance and stability, you can tuck your left toes under, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Stay up, left shoulder to outside of right thigh in three, two, go. 10, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, and 10. Good. Shake out your legs if you need to. You can come up and just do a little downward dog walk you walk. Just release any tension. And then bring the right knee down, pick up your weight, left leg forward. Right arm rows and we chop. Ready? Three, two, go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, one more. Good, stand up, weight over the right shoulder, cross the body, three, two, go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, one more. Good. Switching sides. Just watch where your feet and the weight are. Don't let them meet each other. Right arm down, left arm holds weight, left toes might be tucked under, three, two, one. Go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two more. One more, good, stay up, cross the body, three, two, go. 10, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two more, one more, and you're back. All right, take it down. Come on down to the floor, grab your weights, heavy if you can. This is a little confused, this is like walking and chewing gum. I'm not even sure I can do it well. So, I'm gonna kinda leave it up to you to do it well. How's that? Grab your water, grab your heavy weights. We're going on to our back. For one moment, watch me, I'm gonna do it without weights, but watch what I'm doing. And again, with your hips, you can be in a pelvic tilt on the floor. You can be in a bridge off the floor, knees or legs, your choice. So 
Both arms are gonna come up. As my right arm comes down, my left arm is opening to a fly. So let's see if you can see it this way. One arm presses, one arm flies. One arm presses, one arm flies. Everybody got that? Give me a thumbs up. I know we think we have it to lift the weights go in our hands. All right, so pick up those weights. Try not to make too much out of it. Arms are up over your chest. What's gonna happen is the left arm's gonna flip the shoulder to, so the palm faces front. You can keep it that way if it helps you. Ready? In four, three, two, go. One chest press, one fly. You can keep the arms that way too. If you cannot do this for whatever reason, three, do either or, or do one of each. Four, five, six, seven. Now this could very well be my smart side. Eight, which could be scary for the other side. Nine, one more. 10, now stay here, turn your palms, oh, let's not do that, we'll do that later. All right, so now we've got the right arm going as a fly, the left arm is a chest press. We can try in three, two, one, here we go. One, it's kind of like walking and chewing gum, two, three, four, hang on. Five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, give me one more, ten, and in. Take a little stretch. Is that a little funky for you? It's fine. Something different. We gotta keep our brains occupied too, right? Okay, two, two or one way for a pullover crunch. Here's the deal on the pullover crunch. It's a single leg, a single leg, both legs. So it's single, single, double. All right, so whatever weights you're using, you're just gonna continue to go back and forth. Pick up your weights, come on your back. Arms up, legs are down. As the arms go overhead, let's all do this together. Arms overhead, as you come forward, exhale, right leg comes up, go back down, left leg comes up, go back down, both legs come up, that's one. Good, let's go ahead, two. Single, single, double. Three. Crunch. Four, if you have to let go of one of your weights, single, single, and double legs. Good. Five, single, single, double. Six, together, seven. So it's another one of those exercises that has like a million different things going on at the same time. Eight, single, single, double. Nine. One more second. 10. And up. Nice, stretch your arms up, come up, sit up. Open up the front of your chest and shoulders. So that was technically 30 crunches and 30 pullovers, technically, right? Three for each. All right, let's move on. Go back to that single, <clears throat> single chest press fly. <laughs> All right, it's, it's almost like a bow and arrow. All right, right arm is gonna do the chest press, left arm is gonna fly <clears throat> on your backs, legs where you want them, arms up over your chest. Unless you're on an incline, bring it over your collarbone. All right, here we go. A little itch. Three, two, one. So the left arm opens out, the right arm goes up and down. Two, excuse me, up. Three, 
I like my knees up because it imprints my spine more. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Give me two more, please. Nine. Let's just go right to the other side. Ten. Good. One. Oops, my water bottle. Two. Oh dear, the sun's coming out. How much hotter can it get? Three, four, five, six, seven. Pull those ribs down. Eight, nine, ten. Good. Take a little stretch first. You decide now that you know that there's 30 reps of this. If you want to use two weights, one weight, one heavy weight, one light weight, two light weights, no weights at all. All right? Let's try it, shall we? Let's just do it on your back. Legs down, arms up. If you're using two weights, um, feel free to pull them together. Three, tilt your pelvis, two, and one. So pull over, single leg right, crunch, left, both together. Two. Two, three, crunch. You are lifting your head and shoulders up for that crunch, right? Four, single, single, double, five, single, single, six, single, single, seven, Eight, just two more, or six more. Last one. Oh, sit up, stretch it out. Woo. Good morning, happy Monday. All right, on your back we have a bridge. Good old fashioned bridge with a chest press. You either can keep your hips up in the bridge and just do the close grip chest press, excuse me or um, go up and down with the bridge. See how your body's reacting today. All right, we've got one of those, 10 of those, I should say. On your back, good. Let's bring the hips up if you're starting. You can stay there or you come down with it. We've got four, three, two. Hips down, arms down, one, press. Two, three, Four, articulate your spine. Five, six, seven, eight, two more. One more, and bring it in and down. Good, come onto your side body, right side if you can. If that's the other side, it's fine. All right, so hand behind your head. Top leg up, hit knee ankle, we're gonna crunch in and down, all right? You have an option to keep your bottom leg off the floor as well, that's up to you, all right? Maybe not do it one time and do it the other time. I'll probably go between the two. So you're resting on your right hip bone, left hand behind your head, three, two, go. Crunch, two, so we're meeting our body in half. Option to have that bottom leg off the floor, five, Six, seven, eight, two more, nine, and ten. Sit up, cross the left leg, if that's the leg that was moving, across your body, do a spinal twist or a seated twist here. Should feel pretty good, you might smack, crackle, pop it. All right, on to the other side. Shoulder, hip, knee. Ankle. Now this is my tender side on my back, so I may keep my head down. We'll see how it goes. Three, two, go. One, two, option. Three, four, it's fine. Five, six, seven, eight, two more. Nine, ten. Good. All right, back on your back for your bridge with your close grip chest press. 
If you did it one way before, try it the other way. Maybe keep the hips up this time, or maybe move them, or maybe not. Arms up on your back. Hips are up. Ready? Three, two, go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two more. One more. And bring it down. Put your weights down. Come onto your right side. Shoulder hip knees. Left hand behind your head. Three, two, go. One, two, option. Three, four, five. Make sure you're not collapsing into your next six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Change sides. Shoulder, hip, knee. Right leg up. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, one more, Woo. one, all right, you're almost done, you're almost done, good, all right, on your mats, get set, go. Get onto your forearms. <clears throat> Hips in the air, dolphin pose in yoga. No, we're not doing a headstand, but feel free to take one if you like. All right, forearms down, tuck your toes under, knees off the floor, hips up. We're gonna come forward, chin in front of thumbs for 10 of those, okay? That's dolphin push up. In three, two, go. One, two, three, we're just gliding, four, five, six, chin goes in front of your thumb, seven, eight, great job, nine, I can see some of you, ten, and rest. All right, last thing is nice, a nice dog, uh, down dog. Tuck your toes underneath you. Oh, that's kind of slow. All right, right hand to left ankle, and switch left hand to right ankle. 10 alternating, not 10 sets. Ready, three, two, go. Right arm, left ankle, left arm, right ankle. Three, good. Four, option to come into a plank in between. Six, seven, Eight, depends on where you want to be on this right now. Nine, one more, your shoulder's tired. And 10, right? If your shoulders are tired, you may not want to add that plank in there. On the other hand, it's only 10, so maybe we want to throw it in because this is our last set, all right? So wherever you are, hang on just for a few more counts. Get to your forearms, press through the forearms, Tuck your toes underneath you, lift your hips up, dolphin pose, push your forearms to the floor, hips up. Chin in front of the, uh, the fingers in three, two, go. When you come forward, make sure your back doesn't collapse, that your belly doesn't drop to the floor. Now you stay nice and strong through your quads. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and ten come to your knees take a quick little stretch oh. all right downward dog tap your ankles let's go hips up three two let's go tap your ankles maybe you come to that plank one maybe you stay up in dog two three four five, six, strong throughout, seven, eight, nine, ten, down, child's pose, done. All right, Monday morning, you did it. Come
come into a child's pose, bring your arms behind your back. Interlace your fingers, palms together. Reach your arms back away. Good, we're just gonna lift our hips up and stretch a little bit more into the front of the shoulders. Breathe. No weight on your head, please. And then sit back on your heels, lift your torso up, and pull your knuckles to the floor. Lift up. And then come back in. Hands on the floor, step your right foot forward, and hold on the inside of that leg. Just let your knee come forward or your weight come forward off your knee. Take your right hand on that knee and twist. back to center. Just switch legs. Again, be careful of your weights. I only say that because one day I wasn't. Not set. Take your left hand on your inner thigh and twist. Hands to the floor. Sit back in your child's pose one more time. Good, walk your hands in, tuck your toes under, sit back through your heels, and then come into a standing forward fold. Let your head rest, relax, shake it out, yes, no. Take your arms one more time behind your back, arms up. Roll up slowly, take your time. Come up, roll those shoulders back and around, take a big breath in, bring your arms all the way up, stretch. Uh. Open up your arms, pull your chest and shoulders open. Cross one arm over the other. Open the other side. And release, flip the shoulders, roll around. Take a big breath in everybody. Let it go, give yourselves a big hand, stay home safe and stay healthy.